So if you're like me and you just requested the full self-driving beta button, I'm gonna show you how you should drive for the next week. So what you need to do is make sure that you drive kind of like a grandma would. So really slow, don't make any side left or right turns very quickly, otherwise you're going to get a negative driving score. So you can see here, I'm taking this just like a grandma would in a Buick, about nine miles per hour. Now, of course, I'm in a residential area here, so I don't wanna go over the posted speed limit. I know that's not part of the safety score, but that is going to allow you to slow down and not have to slam in your brakes, which is harsh braking is negatively going to impact your score. So again, I'm doing a circle here and I don't wanna to go too fast around the circle, whipping my car around. So I'm going just like a granny would at about seven miles per hour. That is for the next week. Now, of course, the safety score is gonna continually monitor your behavior in the car. So if you have requested the FSD beta, some of those little options did say that FSD beta could be revoked. So I think if your driving score gets too low, then FSD beta will be revoked. So just like a typical granny, I'm not gonna run through the stop sign. I am actually gonna stop completely. And so now I'm gonna turn using my turn signal as well. So make sure when you're out there for the next I guess six or seven days that you're driving really slow. If you haven't checked it yet, I went live and did a full video of the software update. So go check that out. That is on my YouTube channel. I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Make sure you share this video with a friend and don't forget to hit that subscribe button. As always, I will see you guys in the next one.